actually about to announce her commitment and uh, actually has already done it and is going to sign her letter of intent for Lynchburg University here this afternoon at a ceremony at Orange High School. Uh, what made you decide on Lynchburg? Um, it felt like home. It was just one of the places that I was looking at and it just felt like all the girls were super welcoming and they have my major and I love the competitive spirit that they have and the coaches were just amazing and super welcoming. You mentioned your major. What is that? Um, I'm going to major in nursing. Okay. Yes. So that's right up your alley. <laughs> yes. It's, was the distance also a part of that? It's um, it wasn't too far. It's only two hours, but mm -hmm. that definitely played a role because I didn't want to be too far from home, but mm -hmm. I also did not want to be super, super close. So. Yeah. When you look back at this season, I mean, Orange won more games this year than any point in the last 15 years. So you're going away. What are your feelings going away from volleyball now from this school? Um, it's, it was definitely sad ending <coughs> it, but also at the same time, it was a great legacy to leave behind and for the younger girls to kind of follow in our footsteps and hopefully they can go even farther in the future. So. Yeah. It, the, you finished uh, second, got an automatic playoff spot. Yes. And you actually hosted a home playoff match. And... That's something that happened here in quite some... Actually, you did it back-to-back -back years, which I'm not sure if it ever happened before. Uh, at least probably the last time was Kelly when she yeah. played here. So, um, yeah. it was the playoff matches, were they different uh, in terms of intensity? Um, I think, especially with our opening round with Pike, it, like, we came out with a very different intensity. Like, we came out knowing, like, we have to do this, and we really wanted another shot at Cedar Ridge, which we gave ourselves that shot. So. Yeah. Um, what are you going to remember pl about playing volleyball here at Lynch? Um, I think it was just a lot of fun like overall and we really pushed each other on and off the court and there was a lot of growth like looking back at my freshman year like I never would have thought like all of us would have been here um, at the places we were at our senior year. So. Mm -hmm. And you went against in the Central Carolina Conference especially during your junior year you were going against the best teams yeah. some of the best teams in the state yeah. so whatever Lynchburg has to throw at you there you'll be ready for yeah of course always. did that make you a better player I definitely think it did it definitely like <laughs> we, we faced some challenges and it definitely on and off the court gave us some challenges that made us all better so yeah. what are you gonna miss about um definitely all the girls I'm definitely gonna miss all the girls and playing and like being to have all those moments in the locker room and stuff mm -hmm. when we come back so yeah now Erin Jordan Cornell told me that she was the mama bear for she definitely <laughs> was yeah she definitely was what were you um, I just, I kind of felt like I like motivated everyone. Like I just kind of, when everyone's down, I was like, all right, like let's go, let's refocus and let's just, just keep pushing through. Yeah. So. Well, I'm, that'll be the role that you left behind. Yeah. And it's taking all the way to Lynchburg and played to be P3, not yes. a lot of players go to college, but actually managed to do that. Congratulations. Thanks. Thank you.